Okay, hello, welcome to the official very first session of Sally Tells the Truth. Uh, today, as you saw in the intro video, I am going to be reviewing the Biocidin hair removal tool and skin rejuvenation tool. Okay, 
So I'm not going to get all into how to use the tool because there's already plenty of enough videos out there already describing how to do it and it's really easy. So that's a good point I'd like to start off with is that the ease of use for the tool is very easy and I'll talk a little bit more about that later. But how I got started with the tool is I went to uh, one of those do-it-yourselfer YouTuber channels that's kind of famous and I used her code and went to her, her Amazon store and uh, paid well over $300 for this at-home use tool and um, right off the bat when you read the directions it says that it could take anywhere from up to one or two weeks for a hair to fall out and I'm like okay wait what um, nobody told me that before I bought it um, Back in the 90s, like in the late 90s when laser first came out in the doctor's office, everybody was rushing there to get, you know, their mustaches and every, their facial hair and everything corrected. And, you know, they told you that, you know, wait a couple days and the hair should fall out. And if it doesn't, just take the tweezers and get rid of it yourself. And then we're going to schedule you anywhere from 5 to 10 sessions and then you should be completely cured of your hair problem. Um, for some people that worked really fabulous it worked really great i know for me back then it slowed things way down but it didn't quite completely get rid of it so here we are 2020 and um they've got these little tools for use at home and um it's painless it doesn't hurt which is another really good point um of it but the whole having to wait one or two weeks you know um i do have a little that's kind of a a, a con so that's con number one but the Pro number one is that it's really easy to use. So I want you guys to stick with me through this whole review session because at the end, I'm gonna show you some mind blower things that you absolutely have to know before you invest in this tool and it's for your best and highest good, okay? All right, so um, in these do-it-yourself channels, uh, I want you to know that, um, I was gonna say this for the end, but I might as well just tell you now. A lot of these people are flying over to foreign countries where they are getting professional work done. And they, some of them have made the mistake of actually telling us and filming it. And so now I'm in total question of, okay, so what's real and what's not real? Did this tool do the job or was it the work you just had done over there? You know, the, the, the stuff that you just paid a, a boatload of money for. So I don't know what the truth is. And that kind of like immediately like broke my trust. So now I feel like, okay, well, I'm going to have to buy this tool and try it out myself. And that's why I created the channel or the, the series now, Sally Tells the Truth, because um, I have nothing to gain. I don't have an Amazon link. I don't want to make money from this. Um, I'm, I'm more about, you know, I'm a Libra. We're all about justice and I just want to have people's backs. And so um, that's why I am going to be doing a series of Sally Tells the Truth because um, I don't get like a lot of professional work done. And if I do, I'll tell you. Now, um, I did get fillers done a year and a half ago and it's completely worn off. And there's another tool I'm gonna be reviewing. And just so you know, not every tool I review is gonna be a poo-poo, okay? Some of these actually do work. And I, so I wanna encourage you guys to click subscribe and be looking out for that because some of them actually do work very well. And I, it's kept me out of the doctor's office. So I will be 100% completely transparent and tell you exactly what I did, how I did, when I did it, and then hopefully you'll get the same result. Um, so anyways, in my experience with the Biosyn, I never saw a single hair fall out. Um, it's, you know, after the third treatment of using this tool, I finally decided, hell with this. I just cranked that baby up all the way on high, even though it says for my skin tone to only do it on this number, I just turned it up all the way and went to town. Now it does have a really nice cooling feature. So when it gets too hot, you can put the ice cold stuff and it kind of cools it down. However, um, when you saw at the unboxing, there's all these like little special like cupping, like attachments that, you know, kind of like, you know, cup on and it's a magnetic cup. So it just kind of latches on, which is really a fantastic feature. However, once those get hot, you just have to turn the whole machine off and let it cool down. Um, and another thing I didn't like is they are encouraging you to shave your legs first and shave your armpits and stuff first 
before you use the tool. And I don't know about your experience, however, for me, whenever I shave my legs and I start shaving again, that is a no-no. Boy, the hair comes back like that, and it's like I wasted a year of my life waxing and going through the pain of getting used to ripping that wax off, and it's like I just threw all that hard work down the drain. And so that's kind of what happened this time. I'm noticing that there's a lot of hair growth on the my, parts of my leg that I had pretty much destroyed the hair there, and now I'm starting to see like some regrowth um, happening there. So back to the wax. Okay, um, so, you know, excuse me, I'm trying to be as quick and as organized as possible when I do this video. So, um, anyways, um, when you zap, okay, and like I said, it's really easy. There is even an automatic bullet ba -da 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 mode. The zapping is very slow and it's time consuming. So that's another con that I didn't like about the machine. However, the fact that you could just press the automatic button and just kind of like, yeah, relax, that's a that's a that's a pro so again you know there's a pro and a con I like to be you know more you know consecutive where I can just zap 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 and be done okay I don't have all day I've got other more way more important things to do if you have kids you're even way your time is even way more tied up and um, what if I just want to have some fun? <laughs> if I want to get online and play some video games or, you know, watch a little bit of TV, I don't want to waste an hour of my life having to do my whole face area. And, you know, and also a quick note, I was zapping the hair three times, even though you should only have to do it once or twice. I made sure I was doing everything I could in my power to make sure that this tool worked. And so, um, I figured, Okay, they, there's all kinds of videos coming out right now saying that you need to stay with this tool for a total of 13 weeks in order to really see the full results. Who's got time for that, you know? Um, I'm like going on my fifth week and I finally got so frustrated with the long peach fuzz. And you know, being Native American, sometimes in the sunlight, that peach fuzz, it can look kind of black. So depending on which way the sunlight's gonna hit your face, you're taking a big risk by just letting it grow. And I know that there's some ladies out there, they do this dermal planing stuff where they're like scraping a layer of their face off. I'm way too afraid to do that. I don't think that's a good idea personally. Anytime you shave, cut, or whatever, for me, that just encourages the hair to grow back faster. And I, I don't think that's a good idea. Um, and so this tool is time consuming, which is a down. Because even when you, even when you're pressing the button and you're firing and you're trying to make it go like a little bit faster, like zap, 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 do it again, zap, 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 zap do it again. Um, you know, it, you, it can only go so quickly and you pressing the button isn't gonna make that happen. So you might as well just put it on auto mode and just, you know, let it do its thing. But once it gets hot, you have to unplug and let it cool down for five minutes, which makes it super duper time consuming. Okay, um, see here, um, it's painless. There's, you know, unless you're on like the third or the fourth zap, which, you know, I wouldn't do any more than three. The book says you should only zap one or two times. The company I've spoke with said, yeah, don't do more than two. I did three just to make sure. <laughs> Um, but yeah, um, it, after that, then you will start to feel the zap, okay? Um, but here is the final verdict. Um, here is like the, the big, big clincher is, you remember how I just mentioned that you should stay with the tool for 13 weeks? Guess what? There is only a four week, 30 day return window. So if you got it, if you have not seen a single hair fall out on its own, or it start to get thinner in that area and kind of sparser, you know, maybe falling out while you're asleep or whatever, if you're not noticing results, you only have a four week window to return the tool. So you'll never really know if it works or not. And so who the heck would ever, ever want to back up a company that pulls that kind of garbage? And I mean, it just almost makes me a little bit upset that, okay, I got to take a risk of investing $300 for a tool that may not work. 
and if you're not seeing results and because I was just just barely like a little over the four week mark I had to get had to call up Amazon talk to a representative state my case and luckily they extended some grace time to me so I already have my return label printed out so as much as I really wanted this tool to work and um, even with my best efforts um, I just have to say it's a no for me and I'm really really sorry to do that and say that to the company but unless you are willing to change your company policies and you're willing to give people the 13 full weeks it's gonna take to see results I feel like you're a dishonest company and just for that alone I will never support your products that just disgusts me right there it's, it's a no for me I wish that I could say that you know you know it did work and oh here's the other here's the biggest mind blower of it all nobody tells you this guess what this this laser it only has so many programmed number of zaps so it's not like well hey I can take my time with the tool it's mine forever right no guess what once you reach the max number of zaps the tool no longer works it stops working and you're stuck with a dead tool so yeah mind blown right there that is another thing that just gets me like my voice I'm like getting really elevated right now um, calm down that right there is like another like my second big uh -uh, absolutely no go no company should ever do that um, I don't understand why the tool only has so many programmed zaps in it but I just felt like that's kind of a sneaky thing to do so I would really like an explanation as to why that is you know maybe the tool can only handle lasting that long you know um, maybe your hair problem no matter how many areas of your entire body should totally be eradicated by those number of zaps but why put a limit on it in the first place and you know um, isn't that what the extended warranty is for I don't understand why they're limiting the number of zaps but that to me is not okay that shouldn't even be a thing so love you guys I hope you enjoyed this review and that it um, didn't drag on too much but you know I had a lot of you know secret information to reveal to you guys and so if there's a product that you would like for me to buy and review please uh, drop your comments down below and click sub subscribe it would you know as if I can get the truth out to as many people as possible and protect you guys and have your back um, that's what I feel is you know partially my calling here to, in doing this and taking time out of my life to make these videos so I appreciate everyone and I'm gonna sign out before this gets any longer so yeah drop your comments and please click that subscribe button mm -hmm. love you guys namaste have a great day